hello guys welcome back to my channel and today i will be showing you how to um make this crochet stitch that is very very cute and very very interesting okay so with with my project i will be show i will be using this 2.5 millimeter hook this is kind of um my favorite at the moment okay and i will be using my um acrylic yarn okay so to start with we're going to make our slip knot and we will be chaining okay uh with mine i will be chaining 20 okay so you can you can chain how many do you want okay if you're like making this for a scarf or a skirt or whatever okay you will just have to work your measurement one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty okay so I will just make like that and then from here block this uh, last chain okay and you are going to chain one two three okay and then with the one that you block off okay you are going to insert there and then make your double crochet okay and you are just going to make double crochet okay each of the the chain that you made okay so just double crochet this is one double crochet in each chain until you finish your chain <coughs> pardon me okay so we're just going to continue that so we can go to our next row okay so just every every chain just to a double crochet Okay, we're getting closer okay and we have two more and the last one okay so okay so we have that guys as you can see okay so from here chain one okay turn your work okay so with this one i'm going to show you and we need to use a trick for this okay so insert into the same stitch okay the first um stitch okay and what you're going to do is you have to put your finger okay so you can use any finger but with mine is i'm using this finger okay so to have that so we can we can create the tassels there and then pull up the yarn and as you can see we have that okay and then make a single crochet now i'm going to show you that is how what we made okay and then go into the next chain okay do the same okay just hold that okay and pull up the yarn and then single crochet okay so we have these two here okay so next and hold it and pull up okay and single crochet go to the next next chain pull up pull up the yarn okay and 
okay so you have to sometimes you have to hold it tight so it doesn't come off single crochet move to the next hold pull up okay so the next hold it and pull up single crochet okay so as you can see guys this is what we created just give me a second i'll just pull that up so we don't lose it okay so this is what we created so that's kind of like tassels okay so we have there and then this is just the thing okay it just give that nice tassels on the top okay so we are going to continue okay so this is kind of a bit tricky but when you used to it it will be easy okay so next in the next chain okay insert and then what you do is hold this okay and pull up from the top pull up your yarn and then single crochet into the next hold it okay pull up okay so you're holding that there and then pull up your yarn okay insert then pull up okay so you're holding and then single crochet let it go insert okay insert your finger there pull up your yarn and then single crochet let it go the next okay single crochet and let it go okay and single crochet and then let it go okay so we are just going to continue that until we get to finish our row okay so just make sure that okay you hold it properly so your work will be at least identical okay it will be the first one is kind of um difficult okay you have to get that get used to it and then you will be working in like on your speed in no time okay and we are going to do the last one okay okay and there you go so we are we just have finished our rows as you can see there okay that is how it looks like okay so we're going to the next row okay we're going to chain three and turn your work okay and we're going we are not going to insert this because we have the chain three here so we're going to go into the next chain and just double crochet so in this part it's just double crochet in each chain until you finish this row okay so just continue that 
until you finish the row and I'll come back and show you what to do next okay guys so I'm about to finish my row so I just want to show that with you guys okay so this is the the last one okay and from here we are going to chain one okay and then turn our work and then what we're going to do is the same so insert in the first chain okay and then we're going to make our tassels again okay okay so insert into the next and then hold at the back okay hold like this and then pull up okay and single crochet insert into the next release and hold it pull up your yarn and single crochet insert release and then hold it okay pull up the yarn and single crochet okay so you will be just doing that okay until you get to the end and then i'm going to show you um, to change the color and how to change color and how to do your rows okay guys so so this is our second row okay it's really it's really pretty okay so continue that guys continue that and i will sh and i will come back and show you when when i got here i'll show you how to change color and what to do next okay guys so i'm here to my last stitch okay and before we finish that i'm going to grab my other color and let's change our color okay so we'll just insert my color there and pull this up and then we're going to chain three okay and we are just going to continue working our double crochet okay so this chain here we don't have to work on that because we have that so jump to the next one and do our single uh, double crochet okay okay so continue that guys and i will come back and show you when you get to the end okay what to do next okay guys so i am here into my last stitch so double crochet and then chain one okay so what we're going to do is the same okay insert okay and hold that and then pull up and we are going to create that okay so we are just going to do the same thing okay and until you finish your row so every time you change color this is how you're going to do it okay or else um if you want to have like similar plain one color and then on top of that is you want to put just the the top is you're going to change color you can do that as well okay you just have to work it okay on your way okay guys so that is how you make this crochet with tassels okay it is really really cute okay thank you very much guys for watching and um please leave a thumbs up and if you like this video 
and if you're new to my channel please hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you get notified every time i posted a new video and for all my subscribers thank you very much guys for your support and i will do my best to make um videos that is very very interesting and uh, um and also that you will like okay thank you very much guys and have a lovely day everyone and see you to the next video bye